Mega is going to be using. Is this Twink Ike or is this Twonk Ike? This is indeed the Twink Ike. Very nice. Good choice. Honk Ike? Not it. Absolutely not. Twink Ike is much better. Honk. Honk Ike? Mm-hmm. Three, two, one, go! Game one. Talon City. I was already taking a pretty aggressive start controlling the stage. Mega though, quickly gonna be reversing the position, trying to get something started with all of these falling neutralers. Look at the way that Mouse is positioning himself. He's positioning himself diagonally under Mega, so that he would be forced to commit to drifting in with his neutralers in order to connect. <laughs> intimidated! They intimidated him! Is this, is this the power of the Ike Master? Ah, the power! Ah. Oh my god, Mega almost died there too. Ooh, ooh! Getting, getting a little, a little parry, a little, uh, getting a little cute, a little adorable. Little sexy, you know, getting a little, little with it. It's like I know what you're doing. I know what you want. I know what you want. What you want? Okay. What does that mean? You like ten. Okay. Like... <laughs> yeah. Will there ever be a day I won't be I won't be like verbally abused for how young I am? I mean, you up here. Just kidding. No, it's completely that's not... uh, and entirely up to yourself and your actions. Yeah. And your what does that mean? Kevin with the call out. So you're telling me because I say poggers Big and I act like Big little kid energy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, big uh, Roblox energy, yeah. Oh mm, god. What if I act like this until I'm 40? Like I'm 40 years old, just so you can have a be... big little kid energy as an adult. Yeah, look at me. <laughs> back to the match. Yeah. Woo, guys, DK Will is waiting. Woohoo! Well, thank you for the raid, DK Will. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually been pretty good so far. Uh, good job to Mega and Mouse Rad. This has been a very low, like, so far, it's kind of hilarious. No, no, shout outs to Mega for being like some of the spice back. Yeah. Look, like, like, he's, he's, he's putting a little pep in his stuff, you know what I'm saying? Oh! Ooh, uh, uh, just that to go seems... for the early skull bash. That was insane. And this is the mouse rise, like, yeah, I'm just gonna go to the blast. I'll meet you there, fam. And he's like, your opponent's like, no, I'm not going there. Like, he's like, oh, okay, it's fine. Oh my god, what is Mega doing? Mega going okay. oh, off stage, he didn't have to commit like that, but he's gonna die for it. And just like that, this is completely yeah. over for Mouse Head, despite that early SD. Yeah, man, you don't want to get off stage <laughs> control like that. <laughs> but alright, you know, uh, sick, uh, sick, sick air dodge read, honestly. It's like, after all those times in the last time that they played, uh, Mega kept just doing down smash. Now I can finally see why he was doing it so many times. Jeez. Right, let's see uh, what they're banning, what they're doing. Ah! Alright, so we have Mega. He's going to be banning two stages. He is banning... FD and Kalos. If you mix 50 gallons of 2% milk, do you get 100%? No. Ready? Well, I guess you could evaporate the milk down to one gallon, then maybe. I'm so happy I got you thinking about this. Yes, absolutely. You'll yeah, that's be getting 100% milk fat. You'll get 100% milk fat. Well, yeah, actually, I guess you'll have some of the residual solids, too. Mmm, delicious. Yeah, they're disgusting. Well, I wonder what pure milk fat tastes like. Uh, I'm sure it tastes amazingly disgusting. Uh, probably similar to butter. Okay, fine, uh, whatever. Just a, just a thought I had. Um, with Zoilus, Mouse Rat, starting off the complete opposite this game so early, almost getting that spike with down B that he was looking for, but Mega really, really smart to delay his recovery, trying to Ooh. bait an approach with his empty hops, um, but Mouse Rat able to properly lead his distance on it. 
Yeah, we see uh, Mouse Track kind of gave up the stage there. Um, and Mega is able to hold it pretty well overall. Every time that Mousetrap tries to come in, even if he gets a Thunder Jolt in, uh, Mousetrap, uh, Mega immediately gets like a nice counter punch. Yo, Mega up smashing in neutral? <laughs> Hide that. Let me see. Let me see another down smash there, bro. I understand. I get. I get. I understand what you're doing now. I'm picking up what you were putting down. <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> I'm picking up what you were putting down. <sighs> okay. You know, good. Uh, good call out. Honestly. Yeah, but really impeccable the iron Mega's approach is still able to see that for so long. Gonna be looking for another up air, so you see Mega preemptively jumping. You know, it is, he has, and just in case, he has to land aggressively. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you charge it at all? Why did you just let it rip immediately? Why would you just let it rip? Like, a, like, a, like frame one, just let it rip. When you saw that he whipped. I must have been a dash attack. Wait, 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 wait. I don't think that F Smash was supposed to be a dash attack, and Mouse Rat missing for the dash attack. Mega right now is just struggling to land. Ike has such a bad disadvantage, but able to actually successfully air dodge out of the Ike has a bad disadvantage? Yeah. I don't, I don't know if I necessarily believe that. What does he have? Well, he doesn't have any buttons. He can air dodge. What else can you do in disadvantage? He is near. Also, like, all of, his, all of his buttons have pretty little landing lag, considered. Yeah, I don't think he's, like, particularly fast, fast. I don't think he has, like, necessarily, like, that terrible of a disadvantage state. Although he definitely doesn't have, like, any really good get-off buttons. Unless you're directly in front of him, in which case he has, like, nah. Mm -hmm. But honestly, that could just be, like, my nest privilege coming out. Because I'm like, haha, three and five, <laughs> now go. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna press this button and you're gonna get hit. Yeah. yeah, that feels bad. Oh, why though? Oh, they do die though. Oh my god, why is it? Why is he have the spring shoes on? <laughs> I think that was the longest period of time that Mega has spent on the stage in like the past minute. Every other time he's like bouncing, like he's wearing bouncing shoes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what is that reach? Okay, I respect it. Yeah, that's what, <laughs> once again, uh, over committing at such a dangerous percent, that is so risky. I don't even know if it would have killed I could have set stage two. Uh, that's what the sad part of it feels like was there. This is a oh. pretty, pretty good lead for Mega. Sometimes yeah. you just forget, like, where, what percent is at. Or, like, you're not paying attention. Because you're like, I'm so sure I'm gonna hit them with this, I'm gonna go for it in the place. No, it, I'm not it is wacky seeing two T jolts go the opposite direction. <sighs> just go set up the tech chase, but you know, it doesn't find it, just goes for the tech chase, which I think was a strange commitment. Can yeah. you get like a jab lock F smash? I'm pretty sure you can, yeah. Or at least a down smash. That would mm -hmm. cover every option. Yeah, I just feel like it was a strange choice to go to off four with it down tilt there. Yeah, it was. Uh, well, I guess he was, just, uh, he was just gonna go for the, uh, the edge guard. But that's neither here nor there. Uh, this man... Still managed to get the kill. Yeah, absolutely. This is still, like, 100% doable for Mouse Rat. Uh, those uppies are... That, that's a very questionable uppie, and look at that. Now he's forced to bring his double jump, forced to land against Pikachu. Ugh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm having the time of my life. <laughs> that sounds so sarcastic. It's not. No, <laughs> you sound so checked out right now. It's kind of... Me? No. Yeah, a little bit. All right, it's, it's fine. Um. Oh, okay. No, 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 no big smash. That's the time I would think he would go through like the bonky F smash. Yeah, I was expecting that too. I was like, just go for the up smash, bro. It'll kill. It's Pikachu. It's mad light. Mouse Rat, yeah, I no. can really, really tell when Mouse Rat is like setting up a key jo uh, thunder because he like always slightly pauses in his jump. Um, but unfortunately, he was right under the Town City platform, so the uh, Thunderbolt actually didn't go all the way through. Uh, unfortunately for him, his block is all the way back. 
good skull bash. Just a quick way of getting out of there. So, so smart. I like that a lot. Understanding that I cannot get there in time. Mega's looking for that roll. That was not a... If they were not playing on time, that would have been bad. Oh, my goodness. But this is a great counterpick for Mouse Shred. He managed uh, the counterpick coming in clutch. Okay. Um... What do you think? As you talk about that game, I'm going to try to pick up some pistachios. Oh my blow. god. <laughs> so you saw like at the last second, uh, if it had been literally god any other it. stage, literally any, any other stage, uh, Mega would have definitely taken it with that Nair to up air. He was at just the right percent to, to get the confirm, but because it was Town and City, which Mega did, didn't ban, uh -huh. uh, because he had won the first game there, that ended up kind of biting him. There were a lot of really good. Uh, there were a lot of really good stocks from those players, though. Well, there were definitely some flubs in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, probably the biggest flub being the um, when Mega when Mega did the upbeat the wrong way, and Mousecrat tried to punish with a forward smash, which I think honestly was the dash attack. That was pretty not great. Yeah, that was definitely not a pog. That was a bit of a wing champ. Oh um, my god. This is a I'm little kid energy. No, no, it's, it's fine. Don't change yourself. We're not going to afford you to change yourself. Oh, we're going to PS2, though. Yeah, uh, no, keep giving Pikachu and I. Yeah, this is part of who you are. <laughs> so, yeah, you have... you want to be. Ready? I have the protagonist of my own anime. I mean, let's not go that far. A lot of little kids who. No, <laughs> don't, don't say that, Devin. A lot of little kids are like, I'm the protagonist of my story. Are you like, not the not. one of your own? No. You have to live with that kind of guys. One, guys, a little philosophy. Go. I feel like we have all the time to do that. <laughs> we'll talk about that. We'll talk about this the way I think about life. If you don't consider yourself the main character of your own story, you no longer have, like, obligation. You don't, you don't have any sort of obligations to hold yourself up to a standard. You have to hold yourself up to a certain standard and treat others with a certain amount of kindness. Because you are the protagonist of your own story. You're the one that people will look up to. And if that's the case, you have to be respectful of um, others as well. You know what I mean? You have to support others. And that is how you be a good protagonist. Others okay, will support sure. you to support others. Whatever you say. I don't think we should be talking about this right now. <laughs> Even if we have all the time in the world. Damage has been dealt. Oh, that's a good point. Alright, yeah. Oh, no, that's right. 77, Devin. Come on. Oh, 78 almost. Yeah, no, at this, at this point, the damage keeps on piling up. That was a really, really good advantage for Mouse Guy. Getting the double up here into the forward air, but unfortunately, once again, over committing to the Thunder, letting Mega get back onto stage, and that side be actually going to end up trading with the forward air again. Goodness. Yeah, Mouse Rat is reading the jump off the ledge, but not quite timing the down air at the right time to get the uh, punish. And it was a regrab, so there was less invincibility. Mm -hmm. You could definitely see like Mouse Rat's going for down tilts because he wants to get some kind of uh, he wants to get Mega off the stage, hopefully to try to get a kill. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, this. <laughs> 140%. This is like a smash. This is dash attack. Wait, he's dash dancing. He's dash dancing. You know what this means? Yeah. Three, two, one. Let's jam. Uh, no, 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 too yeah, bad. Uh, Mega's jumping. Yeah, Mega's Which... jumping like that. Honestly, there isn't a whole lot that Pikachu needs to do to actually really kill you. Foiler is just... only gonna do so much. Not be off stage. Yeah, just get you off the stage and then try to get. Oh, yep, there it is. There's the dash. The dash attack you were hoping for. Any dash attacks in chat? Any, any QBs in chat? There isn't much that... You're right, though. There isn't, there, there isn't much that Pikachu can do about an opponent that's constantly getting in the air, but that's trying to force them off stage and try to get them Yeah, and, and you off. really don't want to be getting under Ike either because of the way that his nose swings below him. You really don't want to try to be, like, um, um, air airing him with, like, an up air from below. And that's, like, the only thing that could realistically kill from that position. <laughs> Oh, nice up air. Just get up the uh, the bad aerial from Mouse Rat. Mouse Rat, once again, does a good job of covering his recovery with those T-Jolts, making it really, really nice and safe. So something that we're seeing a lot is that neither of these players are really spending any time in shields, uh, because they're both like... I don't know, they're both just expecting, I guess, a swing, so they're just trying to play around each other's range. 
So as long as like either of them are in the uh, are in their vicinity to get to go for a grab or anything, they're always shielding. They're almost never grabbing. And I think the one that kind of catches onto that first can actually get a lot of reward out of it, even though both of these players don't really, both of these characters don't really get that much reward out of grab, unless they guess perfectly on the eye. I like the bait with Mouse Guy. He jumped up front to the platform after finishing Mega the whole game to make him think that he was going to go through a T drill. He wanted to Mega Shred to punish it, but then he just faded back and was able to get a couple of extra hits. I feel like Mouse Guy's kind of in Mega's head right now. He is mixing a neutral so, so well. Yeah. There's definitely death by a thousand cuts right now. And, like, every time that Mega's gotten, like, a hit, it's done, like, a very large damage proportionally. Uh, but it's still really tough to make this up. And you can see, like, a lot of the times when Mega's getting hit in the back with the dash attack, he can't really do much about that. Probably his best, uh, route would be, like, up the end of shields. But he's got to he's got a B-reverse that first. Mm -hmm. Which, that can be really hard to do when you're not, like, expecting the dash attack. Really, really smart for Mega to understand that, like, okay, when he's at, like, really high kill place, like, he needs to be the one jumping constantly. Um, because Pikachu really isn't in a position to be sort of fighting him in that position. Um, and if he is to land at any point, he could be eating the kill point. Um, yeah, Mega's just doing a good job of avoiding all of Pikachu's potential kills, and just living a little bit longer. I mean, do you want to see more, like, more to your point, like you said earlier, Mousetrap never up smashes. Up smash is a decent anti-air. Yeah. If you have an opponent that's constantly jumping, you might want to consider that as an Especially option to throw out. Like, obviously, if he's going to land with neutral later, that could probably beat it out. But but considering how many full cups um, and he wants at least mega tempts to throw out, it could be a decent tool. Let's see, like, again, like, 184. Uh, mega is definitely at a percent, and it's kind of ludicrous, but Mouse Rat isn't going for any grabs. He's only taking these uh, aerial hits because it's the only thing that Mega is giving to him. And, like, yeah. the one time that he gets, like, he gets uh, clipped, it causes a bit of damage, and this is very risky for uh, for Mousetrap right now. You know, Ike is a character that, you know, definitely is a rage monster for sure. Things like back air, you know, will kill exceptionally early, 199%. He is, look, look at those falling in his, look at the way his face is hit. That dash attack almost killed him, setting face. Like... You have to remember that even though um, Rage is nowhere near as strong a thing as it was in Smash 4, it can still lead to some early kills if, uh, if you're playing the right character. No! He dragged down Nail into down tilt? Yeah, it was probably meant to be a down smash, but he uh, missed it. But one yeah. minute left! One stock on Mega. One minute. Well, you gotta peep that timer. And now we're back at the percent where um, that's almost the stock! Like, just barely surviving that. Give me an up tilt, though. Come on. Give me that up tilt. There you go! <laughs> Too bad. You know, I feel like if there was a time to down smash, that definitely would have been it. Uh, you're right. You're 100% right. He was definitely, like, waiting for the, uh, the follow-up there, and that would have been the, that would have broken the shield 100%. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at him, he's just afraid to touch a ground, and because he is afraid to touch a ground from all the T-Jolts, Mousinat is just running the clock. Wait, can he do the thing on PS2 where you stall by bonking you head as Pikachu on the side? Uh, I believe he can, but it's... I mean, it's a lot better for Pikachu, obviously, but I believe he can too, yeah. I mean, Mega's got 20 seconds to take a stock and then do 40%. No, that's it. 40, it's, it's 43%. actually impossible, this is not happening. Mousinat's gonna go away, he's, he's timing him out. Yeah. Nah, no, it's over. He can kill himself and then just come and just wait on the angel platform. He has absolutely no reason to do anything besides just hang out. And now Mouse Rats. <laughs> yeah, he's like, let's, let's just get the seven death screen. Okay, please. Well, that was, uh, did you turn out? Are you excited? Are you, uh,. Is that good for you, Mega? Uh, <laughs> Dara? Delicious. You're weird. Would you say oh that? Yeah, you know, I'm not gonna say it. Um. Okay. That was game three. Mascot is up to three. one. Right? He's up to one. Ready? Correct. Alright. Oh, I didn't even know. I need to punch my bag real quick. Punch your bed. Okay. <laughs> it has been completed. Oh, dark. Don't get violent. Don't get violent. Vitality. Energy. 
enthusiasm. Oh my gosh. That is what we're going into to this next set. Are you ready to help? Are you ready no, to help? I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. That you've ever seen in your entire life. Three, two, I'm already. Is chat ready? I hope everybody's in chat ready for the potential last game of Losers Finals, or it could go to a game five, which would indeed be Poggers. This time, Mega starting off so aggressively, so many nerves being thrown out, and immediately taking control of the stage. But alas, he has yet to get a hit in. And Mousegrat piling on the damage. The Ike off stage, not where you want to be at all, having so much air speed with his side B, just able to completely go past Pikachu as he is recovering. Sick. <laughs> Sorry. Um, alright. I don't know how to respond to all that. You know, uh, I don't either. Okay. Yeah, so despite, like, the last match being kind of, uh, not great for Mega, he decided to go back to PS2. Which, uh, it's a comfort stage. I understand it. And it's not like the last match was caused directly by the stage itself, so... He's willing to try to play out the rest of the set here, I guess. Yeah, it's a pretty comfy one piece stage, but I feel like the plats kind of give uh, Pikachu Wu, like a lot of space to do like what he wants. Gives him like a lot Woo! of space to move around. But goodness, that dash attack almost killing so early. Yeah, it just went straight up. Jeez. <sighs> oh, and that back air would have definitely been the... Mm -hmm. Would have been something. Tries to read like a high recovery from the ledge with the forwarder. I'm not sure that they're really going smart, understanding that that was the time to recover low. Oof. Tries to wait for a defensive option. He doesn't go for the follow up. Doesn't find it though. Tries to go for the F tilt, but just a little bit too late on the execution. A little bit too late for putting the trigger. So I haven't seen. Okay, I was gonna say I haven't seen uh, Mega actually land half tilt up to this point like that well, and it really feels like each time that uh, the mouse right comes back, it doesn't get that much reward from getting mouse right off the stage. Mm -hmm. Mega just put the controller down, I guess. I don't even know what's up. My son slept. My son sleeps. All right, he's a little bit asleep. Okay, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go! Hey, Not for momentum. Smash. Tries to go for the two flame down air, which, by the way, that down air, show sure thing, you know, why go for it all the time, definitely oh. respectable. That was an interesting up B cans. That electric, that, that thunder jolt actually pushed the sword right back inside his hands. Mm -hmm. And he was not expecting it, you can tell when he ran forward, he's like, what, what, what am I doing? What am I doing? No, no dash attack there, you have to mix up. Yeah, that's oh! <laughs> Okay, Mega with the advantage. Jeez, uh, got a little more confidence here. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> he's got a little bit more confidence here, and he's dead. Yeah. Oh. Okay, I appreciate the fact that Mega's not letting um, Mashra get away with doing better jolts. Like from off stage, he's, he's starting to go out a little further. He's, he's, he's playing in a game, he's not playing super grounded. He knows the last thing he wants is to get like a plume out of the jolt into something. Um, so so he just like focuses on having a hitbox in the air constantly to stop out anything that Pikachu can do. It seems like Mouse is struggling to get a hit in. Mega's Mag like super, super defensive. A really good thunder from a uh, from mouse right there, starting to even up some sense a little bit. That's stock lead, man. If you're lapped like that, that's not great. Probably honestly, Thunder is the safest thing that you could do to get on new Mega. Because if Mega is going through so many like jump nails, jump nails, jump nails, there's only so much that you could do to challenge that as a, a kid with a stubby hitbox that has Pikachu. Ah. <sighs> So I feel like Mega is like, yeah, I need to jump, but like when you when you just dash attack in your face, just just grab. Come on, what are you doing? Like, don't just give him like free a free punish because he wanted to jump out of jump out of shield. What? Oh! Oh, you are angry. You are angry. This is kind of annoying me a lot. Yeah. It's like, please punish his moves. If he's if he's doing a bad if he's doing a bad move and you're pun and you're not you're shielding it, maybe you should punish it. He's not grabbing for some reason, so you can do it. Yeah, there you go. Grab him. Yeah, there you go. Now, now do that after you get hit. Any grapplers in the chat? Any grapplers in the chat? So, so close. That would have been so nice. That patience. Okay. Oh, I respect the hell out of that. That would have killed 100% of that landing. 
I think it's like I need to show him down here to kill me. Mm -hmm. Ooh, almost not going to go ahead into him, but again, I feel like Mega is so pitiful with the way that he spaces the side B. Nice after all to take this talk. He is so good with the way that he spaces the side B. Um, Can you see that replay on the, cat, on the, on the rack? You gotta get that jumped off, please. Wait, this is game 5 loses? Yeah, this is game 5 now. So you might actually get your, your game 15. Mom, break out the tandies! It's game 5! Mommy! Fry okay. me up some tendies. Whew. By the way, guys, I'm trying really hard to stay out of the I'm, I'm putting my 110% right now. She wants tendies. Who doesn't want tendies? Who's going to sit down and say, yeah, I don't want tendies? Everybody always wants tendies. Or, or nuggies. One of the two, at least. <sighs> nuggies are so not great. I definitely prefer tendies. And anyone that's like, yeah, tendies are just screwing up nuggies. Like, you don't understand. It's like, you know, it's the different, like... It's not, tendies aren't as processed as uh, chicken nuggets. <clears throat> okay. Game five. We're going to be seeing the one and only, you know the one, Megachon. I'm going to call him Megacoon from now on. In fact, the rest of this commentary is going to be done in complete Uwu speak. Um, I'm going <clears> to <throat> friggin' ban you so fast. Don't yeah, <laughs> you dare. <laughs> you can hee hee all you want. You can giggle all you want. But you know, I'm gonna do it if you if you, you start doing his ooh speak. I'm a boss. I am a fool. Thank you. I think. <clears throat> uh, okay, mouse trap forfeiting. Cool. Uh, hurt my knees on, I guess. Uh, what stage did they pick? Town and city. How did you end up here? Two moon and okay. No, that wasn't finished. I submit to no one. Two. Two moon. Oh, it's 2 2. Let's pray. Good, good. Well, that was a deep beyond, too. Sorry, guys. I didn't get that much sleep last night. I had a quick nap and nap, but I'm not feeling great. This isn't helping either, <laughs> honestly. <sighs> <laughs> oh my god, I love Twitter sometimes. Well, what did you see? Show with the glass. Uh, basically, it's a Mario doing up smash at the ledge, and Sonic coming up with spring, and then uh, Sonic does back air, and Mario does up smash with his face facing forward, and he and he gets hit by Sonic's back air. Nice. Three, two, yeah, yeah, it's not even It's pretty dumb. Anyway, guys, this is Game 5 of Losers Finals. One of these players will be moving on to Grand Finals where they have... Oh, goodness, what's his face? Slips? Slip? Uh, something like that. Something, something along those lines where we have a Belmont who surprised me. Slink. Slink. Why did I say Slips? Uh, <laughs> sitting in Grand Finals. All right. Um, wow. Good super armor from, uh, from Mega to get out of that situation. And Mousetrap actually holding a bit of a lead. Again, we have a situation where Mousetrap uh, definitely has the advantage. But Mega gets four hits, and it's pretty much even. Yeah, but he has still yet to get a single hit. Mousetrap is playing so evasively, and I feel like Mega, not gonna lie, he's kind of holding forward a little bit. This is looking like a really, really rough start. He is off stage against Pikachu. Yeah, when Pikachu has that thunder, he's kind of like just uh, kind of dangling in front of you and be like, "Yeah, if you uh, try to stop me from coming back, and guess wrong, I'm gonna take some damage, buddy." Not Yo, great. Every time I see Mouse got skull bash off stage, I'm like, <sighs> "I must go." My plan needs me. Trying to set up the tech chase again, but a little bit too high. But Pusan, ooh, that the eye on the forward. Definitely did not look too spicy. That was definitely uh, not that picante of a meatball. Regardless, this is quite the lead for the mouse guard right now. Already bringing back the percent deficit and the whole stock up to boot. This is looking so good for him. Mega does not know. He's just in disadvantage. That's just what's happening. He's getting hit. It's like Mouse Trap's like, oh, I have a multi hit move that F2 multi hit moves that hits you in the air. I should be doing this and just racking up the damage because you keep jumping. Look at this, like, Mega's jumping, Mega's full hopping, Mega's landing with Nick. He needs to stop, he needs to shield, and he needs to slow this down. Because this game is starting to snowball completely away from him. Yeah. 
It's like when every one of your jumps gets uh gets stuffed because your opponent has multi hits and they're actually placing you properly. What can you do? Yeah. You gotta change your strategy or you gotta double down. I guess uh, Mega's on that double down team. Mm -hmm. uh. <sighs> and Mega just struggling to get back onto the stage. You see Mouse get being a little bit more generous, trying to bait him into overextending by giving him false space. Um, and Mega just keeps jumping into it, taking hit by hit by hit. All this chip damage is going so up to Mouse Rat. Mouse Rat doesn't care. Woohoo! It's video T Jolt hours. <laughs> T Jolt in the chat. And Mega's like, I'm not gonna keep sliding my head against this wall. I'm gonna try to break through it. Though. Oh! Is that. No, that's not. Really. No, he, he was back, to back here, but he needed the back hit of the controller to be able to get that. Not able to get it, but this time, like has some long noodles. You have a big noodly sword. Mm -hmm. And Mega really risking it all by trying to do by doing that side view. Quite literally <laughs> sliding into Mouse Rat's DMs. Mouse Rat's the eagle one, and Mega's the, the Twitter fella. He's he's. I do still see a path to victory here. Mega needs to. Just... You're right. But it's a boy it's a boy Pikachu though. So no. like it's all because of the tail. It's a girl's hat. A girl war. That means that's a girl. Talk to him. Absolutely. <laughs> Alright, you're right. I shouldn't be identifying Pikachu based on the tail. You're gonna find them based on the hats. Pikachu's wearing that hat for a reason. Okay. That's fine. They can identify as whatever they want to be. Regardless, the point I'm trying to make here is I'm losing my mind. Um, oh, is that, like, is that really your point? Yeah, my, my, my sanity is just gone. Oh, welcome to my TED Talk. I'm losing my mind. Oh my god. This is so bad. <laughs> well, yeah, neither of them have given up. It's just like, yeah, this is Thursday. I'm dropped, guys. It's fine. This is, this is a potential stock to Mega, but... Why don't you tell me, though? Oh, uh, good question. I, I know. I, it must have, like... Skull Bash counter must have gone wrong at some point to make it not, like, entertaining the thought of it. Whether it's because... Some it's like when you're not... Trauma. Some kind of trouble. Yeah, but, like, when you're that low, like, why don't you just go for it? And see, like, hopefully maybe you get the kill. I don't know. Yo, maybe, watch, uh, the, watch the Mega come back. It's over. Skull Bash. Or dash attack. My provider. My lover. Alright guys. You know what time it is. It's real grand finals hours. Mouse Rat is going to be moving on. He's going to be fighting Slink. Is that the tag? Yes, Slink. Slink. Like Good the old Slink Belmont. Game. And I'm gonna tell you right now, Pikachu is Belmont's worst matchup. Absolute worst. Like, Supposedly. undoable. It's it's undoable. I I personally do not have a lot of faith that Slink will be able to do it. Because it is horrendous for Belmont. Yeah, Nigga with the Edward. good manners saying GG's. I know he meant BG's. Oh my god, please check in.